Dutch front month gas, a benchmark for Europe, extended declines amid forecasts of higher than normal temperatures in the UK and continental Europe, which is likely to delay withdrawals from gas inventories for heating, and boosted imports of liquefied natural gas and pipeline supplies from Norway to make up for the loss of Russian flows. Ryanair flew 15.9 million passengers in September, up 13% on pre-COVID levels. Moreover, airline expects to fly 166.5 million passengers in the year to the end of March, significantly ahead of its previous annual record of 149 million reached before the pandemic. Electric car maker Rivian reported an increase of almost 3,000 vehicles in production in the third quarter and reaffirmed its goal to build 25,000 electric vehicles this year. HSBC is considering selling its Canada business, one of the biggest international banking brands in the country. To recall, HSBC in May last year announced it would exit mass market banking in the United States and in June likewise said it would sell its French retail business. Boeing does not anticipate winning approval for the 737 MAX 10 before next summer, which intensifies concerns about the company's timeline for deliveries. It adds to the last week's announcement of Boeing not completing key work needed in order to certify the 737 MAX 7 by December. As Philip Capital Team, we wish you happy and healthy days.